Now, this is what I find interesting. They claim they're Christians. The Republican Party claim they are the party of Christ. One Republican emailed me and said that us conservative Republicans are more in line with Jesus teaching than the Democrats. No, one party is of the devil <laughs> and the other party is of Satan. That's right. I want to say, Pastor Jim, they're the same thing. Now you got it. Some of them waving flags with the name of Jesus. Jesus and Trump ain't got nothing in common. <laughs> nothing I said. That's right. Amen. Five people are dead. Yeah. Because of your leader. That's right. That's right. Five people are dead. Yeah. Been killed out of time now, facing judgment to come. That's right. Because of your leader. Yeah. The Bible said if the blind lead the, the blind, blind okay. that don't just cover religion, that That's cover right. everything. That's right. Both shall fall. If the blind lead the blind, leads the blind both shall fall into the bush. Both. That's the teaching of Christ. 2020 was an explosive year and 2021 came in with an explosion. <laughs> Amen. All the, you know, in the Bible, you got Hittites, Amorites, Moabites. Here in America, you got Trumpites. <laughs> Amen. Now I want you hard head stubborn <laughs> folk to hear the old man. Now the scripture come to mind. Evil men and seducers. Let's work on that, Williams. Mm. How you feeling today? Pray for me, Pastor. I'm praying for you. I want everybody to get this because Amen. you know Paula White is Trump's personal spiritual advisor. So you that don't know who she is, you ain't missing nothing, but She's the false prophetess. Yes. Yes. It was all over social media saying that the Lord said he's sending angels from Africa. Sending angels from South America, angels from Puerto Rico, angels from this. <laughs> and all of these false prophets and prophetess said the Lord told them that Trump will win the election. I'm not for Trump. I'm no more than I'm for Biden. I'm for God. But what I am against is false prophecy. And that lie that you fellas have told on God going judge you. It's going to face you in eternity because we only got one God. That's doing any truth telling. When God have ever made anybody prophesy. When God does it, it's guaranteed to come to pass just as sure as God is God. Because God declared about himself not one word that he spoke. It doesn't fall to the ground. And then he said it does not return unto him void, but it shall accomplish to wherever he sent it and it's going to prosper. So whenever you fellas, men and women, and there was another false prophet this morning. He said he got to repent for saying Trump was not going to win. Well, you was right the first time. <laughs> God ain't the author of confusion. Why are you fellas so confused? That's right. Because you spoke it presumptuously. Presumptuously. You brought these things by your own opinion, by your own views. Yeah. I want to work on seducing spirits. Mm -hmm. Evil men and seducers 
And also I want to get the fourth chapter, First Timothy, First if Timothy you will. And also. I want to travel this from <clears throat> Old Testament to New. Mm -hmm. Viewers, do you have a seducer for a bishop? Hmm. What is a seducer? A trickster. Yeah. A religious con artist. Someone that make a fool out of you. That's right. You follow them. When you look at all these men and women and went down to <laughs> the uh, Capitol building. Yeah. Willing to fight the police. Five people dead. Yeah. Because the God of the Trumpites at the God of heaven. Now, this is what I find interesting. They claim they're Christians. The Republican Party claim they are the party of Christ. One Republican emailed me and said that us conservative Republicans are more in line with Jesus teaching than the Democrats. No, one party is of the devil <laughs> and the other party is of Satan. That's right. I want to say, Pastor Jim, they're the same thing. Now you got it. <laughs> one is of the devil and the other is of Satan. How is it <laughs> that a fool that polls as a president can tell you to storm a government building. <laughs> you know, I'm from the hood. And if you're in the gang, the leader of the gang don't make a declaration that he ain't there. <laughs> from the hood, man, when the gang go out and we mix it up and rumble, Everybody's out. The gang leader's out. He's mixing it up with the other gang leader. But your leader of this people have caused them to error. That's right. And now as a result of so many of you following a fool. Now the FBI is after you. That's right. Now, remember, if this thing would have came from God, oh. you wouldn't be in jail. That's right. You wouldn't be charged with sedition. That's right. You wouldn't be charged with treason. That's right. You wouldn't be charged with being a terrorist. That's right. Even some of them claimed they were preachers. <laughs> and many of them were evangelicals. Yeah. Some of them was waving flags with the name of Jesus. Jesus and Trump ain't got nothing in common. Nothing I said. That's right. How could someone trick you to be such a fool? Now, I'm going to strike this out with Bible. That's right. Because whenever I talk about Trump, oh, man, his, many of his followers, they be on our, web, our website on the message. Blowing it up, calling me everything but a child of God. <laughs> I said, all right, I'm going to get Bible with this. That's right. All right, Williams, are you ready? Amen. All right, come on, let's go to work and cause some pain here. In the book of 2 Timothy chapter 3, we're at verse 12. Follow me. Yea, and all that will live godly in Christ Jesus shall suffer persecution. Now, that don't apply to y'all. No. Y'all, what you did wasn't godly. No. Trespassing is not godly. <laughs> That's right. Stealing things is not godly. That's right. And you claim you are Christians. <laughs> None of you are Christians. Having a form of godliness. This is what you have. In 2 Timothy chapter 3 and verse 5. Fakers, having, fraud. Having a form having of godliness. Having a godliness, form of godliness. But denying, but the, denying power thereof. the power thereof. According, there is no law in this country that says, you know, that Congress can just... Throw somebody out for winning an election because you don't like it. No. 
and you believe it can be done. That's right. You are suckered. That's right. Now you have said, you see that, Pastor Jenny, we know whose side you on. I'm on the Lord's side. That's right. And I'm simply speaking against wrong. That's it. You don't like it because you're guilty. That's right. Mm -hmm. Listen at this. But now in 2 Timothy chapter 3 and verse 13. Parliament. But evil men. Evil men. And seducers. Oh, evil men. Evil men. Evil. One thing I say about Trump, as I, me and my wife was talking, I got to admit one thing. <laughs> he have never hide or <laughs> try to hide his true colors. That's right. Even before he got in the White House. That's right. When he was running for election, chaos broke out in every city. Yeah. Just a, a, as a prefix yeah. of what was about to come. That's right. And That's now, right. how can it? Now, don't be surprised, viewers. I'm not saying I'm prophesying. I'm not saying that at all. Right. But don't be surprised when he get out of office. Give it time. Because he's surrounded by evangelical infidels. Right. But don't be surprised yeah. if they encourage him. The start a church. Oh. <laughs> Don't be surprised if you hear Donald Trump Ministries. My Lord. And the religious slogan, make America great again. Yeah. Don't be surprised. Don't be surprised. <laughs> That's right. Because if you try to start a church, now you're on my territory. That's right. Amen. We was in the barber shop talking yesterday, and one barber, Sean, he said, I said, Sean, I'm going to give a shout out to you. He said, I was in a barber chair. He said, Gino, you know what all of them follow Trump got? He can start the church. Donald, <laughs> Donald Trump Ministries. Wow. Everybody had to start laughing. I said, you know what? Because that's something uh, I mentioned to my wife some time ago. Don't be surprised. Yeah. Donald Trump Ministries. Yeah. All you got to do is be a fool to join. <laughs> Amen. It'll never save you. We're living in the last days, God knows. No doubt. All right, come on, Williams. Listen at this now. But evil men. Evil men. And seducers. And tricksters. Now, when someone seduces you, they manipulate you. Yeah. Con you. How could you blind men and women be so mentally warped yeah. that someone can trick you to invade property of the government <laughs> That's right. and then come back and turn on you and say, you that commit this violence, <laughs> you shall be punished. <laughs> You that done this, you shall be. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. He is the one that sent you. That's right. You are loyal to him, but he ain't loyal to you. That's right. Them are the actions of a false prophet. That's right. They are the same way. The That's false right. prophet is not loyal to you. He's loyal to your money. He's loyal to your wallet. But your soul, he don't care about. That's right. That's right. Are you listening to the old man? But evil men. Evil men. And seducers. No one say, well, you shouldn't speak against the authorities. Any, every job, the job of every God sent preacher. They speak against all oh. powers of the earth. That's right. That try to rival against God. That's right. And then try to hide behind the name of God to justify themselves. Yeah. Waving Trump flags and waving Jesus flags. What is that going to prove? <laughs> what is that? What is that? Nothing. Nothing. Evil men. And seducers. Only an evil man. An evil man. Can get up and con and manipulate a mass crowd of people. Yeah. And then I can't blame it all on him because yeah. it can't be dumb unless done unless you're weak enough to believe it. Talk not much with a fool. What? Talk not much with a fool. And here you got people out there say, we take him back to government. <laughs> we taking it back. Well, where is it? <laughs> That's right. You must didn't have it long. That's right. What did you do with it? Amen. 
How can you take back what's not yours? <laughs> Evil. My God, they should have been charging, running mm -hmm. after God. That's right. Pressing up against the word of God. That's right. You know, when this happened, it made me think of the 13th chapter of the book of Revelation about the beast. The beast. How his speech would be so influential. Yeah. And how they would worship the beast. That's right. Yeah, the Bible talks about how they, how they uh, Trump was not the beast, but he do got the characteristics of a beast. That's right. And they worship the dragon. They worship the dragon. Which, and, and he is a, a servant of the dragon. Oh, yeah. He's one of the sons of the dragon. That's right. Because he's vicious. That's right. And he's a carnivore. Amen. Because he consume people's will to do right. And they present wrong and paint it to be right. That's right. And you religious fakers that claim you're serving Jesus, how can you back a tyrant? Hmm. Amen. Five people are dead. Yeah. Because of your leader. That's right. That's right. Five people are dead. Yeah. Been killed out of time now, facing judgment to come. That's right. Because of your leader. Yeah. The Bible said if the blind lead the, the blind, blind, that don't just cover religion, that That's cover right. everything. That's right. Both shall fall. If the blind the blind. leads the blind. Both shall fall into Both. the ditch. Both. That's the teaching of Christ. Both. Both shall fall into Lord the ditch. Take God. Hallelujah. Shall fall into the, ditch. into the ditch. Meaning both will be lost. That's right. That's right. Amen. Now let me get raw. Hmm. I want to say you're already raw. All right. Well, if it's a word, let me get rawer. <laughs> Lord of God. That's right, Jeezy. Let, let me get raw earth. Someone said, you ruined that word. That's all right, but you got what That's I'm all saying. Right. That's all right. If that was a mass crowd of all people of color. Oh, my goodness. My Lord, my Lord. If any of us would have managed to scale the wall. Oh, my Lord. We would have been falling off like roaches. That's right. Gunshots. That's right. Trump would have been on there. Kill them all. Yeah, that's right. That's raw truth. That's right. Where were the National Guard? Yeah. When they had all these protests in the summer, Black Lives Matter. Yeah. The National Guard was already there to welcome them when they arrived. Amen. Amen. They was already there on the steps. Yeah. Welcoming them when they was arrived. Oh, yeah. But this time you had some policemen taking selfies with rivals. That's right. This is a wicked nation. A wicked nation. Evil. A nation that professed that they know God, but Paul said in works, they deny, they deny him. him. They deny him. That's right. So when they hear us preaching like this, they say, oh, you ain't nothing but an undercover Democrat. No, I'm an open <laughs> holiness preacher. That's right. I'm an open holiness preacher. That's right. And you so-called Christians evangelicals who was all mixed in the midst of that thousand, mm -hmm. talking about you are doing the will of God. God will have never failed. No, never. If this was the will of God, then God's people would have won. That's right. Why? God would have backed them. That's right. God would have overturned everything. That's right. That's right. Failure is not God. So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. Wait a minute. Amen. Do you hear this? In the book of Isaiah chapter 55 and verse 11. So shall my word be that goeth forth out of my mouth. So shall my word. My word. Glory to God be that come out of my mouth. It shall not return unto me void. What? It shall not return unto me void. What are you going to do, William? But it shall accomplish. What happened? That which I please. All these flags with the name Jesus on it. What happened? What happened? Ain't nothing wrong with the name. 
<laughs> that's right. <laughs> that's right. That's Power right. in the name. That's right. But you waving it. What they got to do with it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, that was a bunch of people of color. They would have been shot, bodies oh, yeah. laying everywhere. That's true. That's true. We wouldn't even made it to the door. <laughs> huh? No way. What did Trump do just to clear out a certain area last year? Got the National Guard, cleared people out, tear gas, bats and everything just to stand in front of a church. That's right. <laughs> Amen. Evil men and, and subducers subducer shall wax worse and worse. The Bible says they're not going to get no better. Shall wax I, worse. I want you to listen who's going to be deceived. Give chapter and verse again. Second Timothy chapter 3 and verse 13. What is it? But evil men, evil men and seducers and tricksters shall wax worse. Shall get worse. And worse. And worse. Deceiving. They're going to be deceiving folk and. And being deceived. And they themselves going to be a victim of deception. That's right. That's right. Not only are they going to deceive others and being but deceived, they themselves will be tricked also. I marvel. What was that? A 16 year old young lady got killed? 30 something? Mm. Young girl got shot? Yeah. Young girls out there on the front line think they're doing God's will. That's right. Because they believed they of believe someone it. with a seducing spirit. Seducing spirit. Yeah. Fathers taking their little sons with a sense of pride. True. That's true. Because someone with a seducing, seducing spirit have spoken. This is why it is important to be sound. That's right. That's right. If you are the people of God. You must know when God speaks yeah. versus when man speaks. Amen. I want all of you watching to get this because it goes for your preacher. Yeah. I don't care if he calls himself a apostle, a possum, a rabbit, a bishop, whatever he calls himself. Whatever. When they can't, when they tell you the Lord said this mm -hmm. and the Lord said that mm -hmm. and the Lord said the other. And yet they cannot verify, certify, justify. Yeah. The speech of God from God's word. And if thou say in thine heart. Hear this. In the book hear of, this. Hear this now. In the book of Deuteronomy chapter 18 and verse 21. Don't let the preacher get away and say, well, Bishop, this one said that. That don't mean nothing. No. What did the Bible say? Deuteronomy 18. Apostle so-and-so said this one. Is it in here? That's it. No, I don't want it then. That's right. My job is to preach what's written in the scriptures until Paul said, be instant in season and out of season. That's right. The church, our job is to go to what's written for all of our belief. That's right. Am I right, I said? Amen. Glory to God. Amen. For everything we Hallelujah. Everything, Amen. blessed be God, that we believe. Yeah. We have to go to scriptures. That's right. Not only for what we preach, but for what we do. That's right. We have to investigate our doing. Yeah. It doesn't matter if it look wrong or strange in the eyes of someone else that never seen it. Yeah. The only thing that make it wrong is not if Pastor Jennings feel as though it's wrong. Yeah. The only thing that make it wrong yeah. is when God determined it to be wrong. That's right. That's right. Are right, you listening? Deuteronomy 18 and verse 21. Follow me and get me. And if thou say in thine heart. You say in thine heart. How shall we know the word which the Lord. How shall we know the word. Which the Lord hath not which spoken. Which the Lord did not say. When a prophet speaketh in the name of the Lord. And what? If the thing follow not. If the thing don't happen. Nor come to pass. What? That is the thing which the Lord hath not spoken. All of you that said that he's supposed to be the president. And Biden lost because the Lord says, because angels are supposed to come from <laughs> Africa to help them. Angels are supposed to come from Europe to help them. Uh, 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 angels, angels from the Bahamas, Bohemian angels for the supposed to come. That's right. Uh, Asian angels for the supposed to come. Yeah. What happened? What happened? 
That's right. You know, this is serious business because yep. this is a worldwide act of religious blaspheme. That's right. And members of these evangelical fakers yeah. have fell victim to it because yeah. this is what the danger is when you're not taught scripture. Yeah. When you're not taught scripture, you cannot rise to the occasion of knowing. That's right. Did you hear what I said? That's right. When you're not taught scripture, you cannot rise to the occasion of knowing. So yeah. therefore, you become a follower of foolishness and not an investigator. That's right. Wonderful. I'm a religious investigator. That's right. I want to know, is this thing from God? Amen. I don't care if you get in the spirit and shake and <laughs> thus saith the Lord. <laughs> the Lord said. <laughs> I'm going to look at you. <laughs> what did God say? <laughs> <laughs> Glory to God. <laughs> I want to know yeah. from here. What did he say? What did he say? See, a lot of you go through these churches that got these false prophets. They're very dramatic, like Kenneth Copeland. Mm. You know, they had this thing that was going all around America called laughing in the spirit. That's right. Do you remember this? That's right. Some of you never heard it. These were mega churches. Yeah. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, ten thousand people. All falling out on the floor, all laying on the chairs, supposed to be laughing nonsense. Stop. Stop. For hours, supposed to be under the inspiration of God, yeah. laughing. Amen. All on the floor, tomorrow you're laughing in the spirit. No. No. You're dysfunctional. <laughs> That's right. I don't need the Holy Ghost to laugh. No. No, no. When you don't know scripture. Yeah. There's a blame game that's played. Yeah. You blame events and things on God. God. Then you make God appear to be like a man, a fool. That's right. That's right. And God is not the author of confusion. Of confusion. If all these prophets and prophetess who say they represent God yeah. all got the same prophecy, yeah. all got the same voice, and yet none of it come to pass. When a prophet speaketh in the name of the Lord. Do you hear this? Now in Deuteronomy 18 and verse 22. When a prophet speak in the Lord's name. If the thing follow not. If the thing don't happen. Nor come to pass. Nor come to pass. That is the thing which the Lord has not the spoken. the thing the Lord did not say. But the prophet had spoken presumptuously. See, God is not the author of confusion. No. And this is why I said before and I say again. All of you that put that lie out. That Trump was going to win. Yeah. You got to come back and repent. That's right. You did it openly. You got to repent openly okay. or go to hell for your blaspheme. That's right. All of you church goers that went to these churches and you supported the lie, you got to repent. Yeah. Because you took pleasure in the fake prophecy that took place. That's right. Not only he that doeth the wrong, but he that have pleasure in them that do it. That do it. That's right. Evil men. Evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse. Give chapter and verse again. I want to take my time and soak it. Back in 2 Timothy chapter 3 and verse 13. Evil men. And seducers. And seducers. Shall wax worse and worse. Shall wax worse. And worse. Don't expect things to get better. No. No. The madness that's here in America. And mm -hmm. America would always brag to other countries how religious they are. We are the, we, we have a this standard of godliness. Yeah. Viewers that are watching around the world, America is a sick country. Oh, yeah. It's oh, yeah. a hypocritic nation. It's a hypocritical nation. It's a hypocritical nation. In the book of Isaiah chapter 10 and at verse 6. Let's get Bible for it, William. Isaiah chapter 10 and at verse 6. All right. I will send him. Glory to God. I will send him against an hypocritical nation. <laughs> Amen. Uh, I will send him. I will send. Give chapter and verse again. Isaiah chapter 10 and at verse 6. I will send him against, against an hypocritical against nation. 
You know, when God sent a man, he don't send that man to run hand in hand with that hypocritical nation. No, no. And now in order for you to know that God is against that nation, yeah. God sent men to speak against the conduct of that nation, the laws of that nation, right. the beliefs of that nation, the religion That's of right. that nation, when all these things contradict God. That's right. Amen. That's right. Hallelujah. Glory to God. God sent a man. I will send he him. He sent men. Against an hypocritical Lord nation. Take God against a nation of fakers. And against the people of my wrath. What? And against the people of my wrath. Glory to God against the people of my wrath. Will I give him a charge? Will I go? Oh, hallelujah. Amen. Will I give him a charge? To take the spoil. Take the spoil. And to take the prey. Take the prey. And to tread them down like the mire of the streets. Run them over. R run them over. <laughs> That's right. Take the word of God and run them over. Tread them down like the mire of the streets. Come on, you Trumpites. Wake up. That's right. You evangelicals that have misrepresented God. A true witness. You've got Sinners all over social media mocking you. Fools make a mock at sin. What is that? Now in the book of Proverbs 14 and verse 9. What is it? Fools make a mock at sin. And that's what they're doing. Amen. That's right. They're walking around, no repentance, walking around saying God said this and their conscience is not moved. That's right. You lie. That's right. All of you men and women that said the Lord said when the Lord said Amen. nothing, you lie. Amen. Now, if there's any honesty in you, it will convict your heart. <laughs> yes, it will. If. if but your is. heart is like ice. That's right. When it's 50 below zero. That's right. Don't you expect a drip to take place from that icicle? That's right. Eh? Fools make a mock at Fools sin. Fools make a mockery at sin. But among the righteous. But among them that are right. There is favor. Amen. There's what? There is favor. We look at sin for what it is. That's right. I mean, yeah. even if we're guilty of it. That's right. Amen. Because if we didn't look at sin for what it is, yeah. you won't find us running to repentance. No. Huh? No, no. What make a person run to repentance? Scared of hell. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> huh? That's right. Amen. What knock out that pride and stubbornness? Scared of hell. <laughs> That's right. What make you not repent? Your arrogance. Amen. You know, pride is the downfall of a person. That's right. All right. Now in Proverbs 14 and verse 25. Yes. A true witness. Uh-oh. Amen. You know, I love how the scriptures just rain. <laughs> That's right. A true witness. Witness. Delivereth souls. Yeah. Amen. A That's what witness. the truth of God is over the air for yeah. viewers. That's right. Truth of God is a true witness. True witness. For what reason? Delivereth souls. To deliver your soul. But a deceitful witness. But a trickster. Speaketh. A deceiver. But a deceitful witness. Yes. Speaketh lies. Amen. Amen. Deceitful. All of you that it is playing. Oh, yes. All of you that was told that Trump was going to win by false prophets and prophetess. Yes. What are they? A deceitful witness. Speak what? Speaketh lies. Deceitful witness. Because if God said Trump was going to win. Amen. Ain't no need to storm the building. That's right. <laughs> no. All that ain't even needed. No. God, God, you got to make it happen. <laughs> That's right. See, God ain't got to force nothing to happen. That's right. God wants something. He makes it happen. That's right. That's right. Hmm? Amen.